JD, you and I were tossing a tossing the story back about this just a few minutes before the show started. That article, Breitbart had an article that showed um, what the conversation was on The View this morning. Apparently on The View they looked at that every town ad and we all know The View is three liberals and one less than liberal. Um, and I think the expectation with that ad was that The View would be a great place to show that ad and have the discussion about how bad guns are and guns should not be in the home and we really need to pass this legislation and remove guns. Well the reality was Sherry Shepard and Jenny McCarthy and the was it Juliet Huddy? There was somebody from Fox News on there as well. Those three women they both said they, they didn't say they had guns in the home. I think the Fox woman may have implied that she did. But both Jenny McCarthy and Sherry Shepard related personal stories of when they were in their home with their child and they were afraid. And Sherry's story was, I'm trying to protect my child and I realize all I have is a damn wick, wicker garbage bag. Gar you know, damn wicker garbage can. I really wish I had had a gun. And Jenny was telling a story about sometime when she was afraid in her home. She said, if you've never been that afraid, it, it, it's, I wish I had had a gun. And these were w liberal women on The View and they put themselves in the position of being in the home and afraid and needing to protect their child and they realized that having a gun in the home is the way for a woman to care for and protect the family that she's responsible for and the home that she's responsible for. And that was very surprising to me that the conservative message reached over and it really isn't a conservative message but it's the pro-gun stance is considered a conservative thing but it was quite easily and readily adapted by the liberals on the view and you know we may I may scoff at the view but millions of women watch that and that's women in the home with their children and those women saying to the women who were watching you know what having a gun in your home is kind of a good thing that was a really powerful, I, that must have been a very powerful moment. And it may be the kind of, the, if we need to capitalize on that and share that story out, because what happens when you share the story out, the cover photo of the story is the women from The View. And what I saw when I shared the story out, even though it was a story on Breitbart, the link was clearly to Breitbart, the picture was people of The View. Non-political people who follow me are going to click that story or they're going to read the introduction that I wrote because it's not a super obvious political story. It wasn't like it was John Boehner. It was, hey, this is a pop culture story. I'll read it. And then they go, oh, it's a pop culture story about the view and it's about guns and it's about protecting my home and it's about protecting my children and this makes sense and it's not political but it's logical and that's the way to get the message out to people who are not necessarily political I think that's I think that's pretty cool and I think that's the kind of thing that's the way to turn the liberal message on in on itself these are liberals protecting your home war on women I mean I, I think we can do it, it just takes some, I don't know, art. <laughs>